Hello and welcome to what I call a continuation of my somehow just never-ending torture device. We are now going to play Algeria. As Algeria, we will immediately get... Oh, actually, oh god, we need mandatory service immediately. I didn't... I did not plan this out. I, I still have the AI mod on and the... And then the AI mod... Oh, oh, oh... Okay, I can go ahead and become a protector of France. Okay, the AI mod, normally I always... Algeria always gets puppeted by France. And then they have a decision to annex them immediately. <laughs> oh, <laughs> okay, we good, we good, we good. <sighs> Nevertheless, we're gonna go ahead and make a professional army, and we're gonna start the game. Okay, and now we have a, we in the protectorate of France. You love to see it. That's actually like really good. We got it immediately. You love to see it. I should have gotten the modern conservative first. No, <laughs> I am not smart. I don't care enough. We're gonna go ahead and establish a school system. And we got our social religious schools. Also, France is immediately at Wolf Britain and they are landing in Normandy. Why? Sierra Leone. Yeah, it is... Wait, French Indi Indian territory. Indian Ocean territory, what's that? Oh, it's, it's this island right here. Yeah, you really need uh, that one. Uh, nevertheless, uh, because uh, Britain is landing, uh, France is probably gonna lose a few of their colonies. French, Madras, West Indies, Ivory Coast and Senegal. Okay! <laughs> okay, how is this battle still going on? Okay, <laughs> the French here are just doing as much as they can to win this battle. How? Oh, oh, oh! The longer they take, the better it is for Britain. No, the better it is for France. What is the what is the recovery rate? Hold on a second. They don't have they don't have a recovery rate. Morale recovery 100. Uh, there we go. Britain won that battle. Oh, Paris is being liberated. Also, we just got ourselves mandatory service. We're going to upgrade to line infantry. Okay, now, finally, Britain is not losing immediately. And Britain has a one. F in the chat for the French abuse. So after I'm done building this food industry, so it should help my economy a ton, considering uh, food is currently a little bit more expensive in the French market, unlike sugar and grain. So yet yeah, that immediately bumped out about GDP a ton. We're gonna go ahead and get ourselves a local police force. And we got that immediately, but again, I don't want that. <laughs> I'm gonna be real. Yeah, we can't really do anything law-wise. Also, we are going to go ahead and ban dueling. Line infantry is now a thing we have. We are going to go ahead and get more to the, you know? <laughs> Napoleonic warfare. How did I fail that badly? Right? That is too much money for us, actually. Uh, but we can go ahead and tax services. Luxury furniture, luxury clothes, and wine. And now we're making money. Well, sometimes. Well, not sometimes. <laughs> I'm gonna tax liquor because you all should not be drunk. That's my reasoning. The reason I've got myself line infantry is because I want to invade a Morocco. So equipment adjustment is going to go away in five months. We got ourselves the cotton grin. We got ourselves a devout scandal. And oh, they got Western Sahara. You kind of do be love to see it. That was not sent. Huh, that's crazy. We're gonna build war... War? We're gonna build arms industries, is what I wanted to say. Apparently wood is pretty expensive over here, and I do not have the capacity for logging camps. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and actually invade Morocco now. We have cordial relations. God damn you! We're gonna go for inner Morocco. France is damaging relations. I'm going to improve them. I am... I am your puppet. <laughs> Nevertheless, we're gonna go ahead and get a general. Yeah, why not get a tactful defensive strategist? Right, so we're gonna be losing a little bit of money, but I don't want that, so I'm just gonna do this. We're going to have to go on high taxes for a little bit, but it is fine. Yeah, they are trying to advance the front, which is nice to see. They are only uncertain, which is nice to see as well. So we are going to go ahead and get El Reef, and for nice borders, we're gonna get Fez. And we are not allowed to get the last one, so there's just gonna be a little bit of a Morocco going there. So we're gonna go, so we're gonna go ahead and get war reps as well. Yeah, they have a few more troops than we do. Their troops are worse, but that is fine. They do have artillery, and I'm pretty sure we also have artillery. Yeah, we do. We don't, just don't have it in our conscription sectors. A bit of a whoopsie daisy I did there. Nevertheless, our defensive strategist is absolutely annihilate. We have 100 defense. What? We have the world's best defense. <laughs> We have the world's best defense! Nevertheless, we have pushed into Morocco. Can't believe that. <laughs> we have the world's best defense. <laughs> Slightly stupid. Anyways, we are absolutely annihilating the Moroccans. Faith knows no borders. Tunis! Hell yeah, dap me up, bro! We're gonna go ahead and go back to middle taxes. And they have already capitulated. And 
and I will be able to incorporate everything. You love to see it. Oh, GDP is now two million. Oh my god, <laughs> it's just so based. We may be losing money, but it's based. It's gonna take three years, not gonna do that. I'm gonna go ahead and research my boss. I'm funny. Okay, Albania and Iraq are now on the map. All right, the next target of conquest is quite obviously Spain. But I don't know if we can do that just yet. Well, we actually have better troops if I upgrade. That's crazy. We are losing a lot of money, though. So, unlike Spain... Oh, actually, Spain does have a professional army. Do you love to see it? Uh, we also have a professional army. And they have significantly more battalions than we do. But we do have the world's best defense. <laughs> Which is kind of funny to think about, honestly. But we are just gonna go ahead and now upgrade everything over here because we do have just enough things from the French. Also, we're gonna make cannons. Everything should be very fine. We can actually get gas streetlights, even. And we can get ourselves filing cabinets, meaning even more bureaucracy. We're gonna increase law enforcement. And we have a bunch of base people in our nation. Okay, immediate, immediate revolution right there. Okay, not doing that then. Nevertheless, we're gonna build tooling workshops. Well, a singular tooling workshop. Wait, no! No! Okay, that's very bad. That is very bad, actually. So we're gonna promote this guy to hold every single one of our troops. Uh, then we're gonna make a decree enlistment efforts in all of us. Do we have two states? We can do that because we need all of this money. I want a few more states. <laughs> that's enough. Maybe, probably not though. I'm gonna remove the consumption tax on wine and do a little bit of enlistment effort over here. We're gonna go very high taxes. And this is not good. This is uh, not good in any way, shape, or form. Right, what they need is my capital state, which is of course this one right here. They are sending multiple generals to this front. They're sending a single general to this front. Is my army still, it's just, I think 11 weeks. We might actually be able to take this. We're gonna conquer the West Sahara. Mm, but they have sent a lot of things over there. We did manage to consolidate a ton, which is which you love to see. But uh, wait, why aren't you in the government? <laughs> you bastard. Anyways, we need we need to try to enact laws that they want. I can't enact any laws that they want. Okay, this is our end, boys. This isn't fine. Not in any way, shape, or form. Yep. Very bad. Not good. Very bad, not good. Uh, and he got careful maneuver. Ah, we got 10% more army defense now. Ah, uh, the equipment adjustment. I think the equipment adjustment actually just killed us right there. Now it's one continuous front line. Yeah, we can't do anything. Boys, we had a good time. We fought well, but not well enough. We're now a puppet. And I'm pretty sure friends will just subjugate us. But I'm pretty sure we are a, we are actually a dominion. So that means we can declare wars. Yes, indeed. See, as long as they don't press the button to annex me, everything is fine. I'm just blue now. And look like that. Yeah, attack and defense is 50, 70. Ours is 55 and 75. They have the same quality troops as we do, except they have cannon artillery. Uh, yeah, we can't really do anything against that. I mean, on the defense, we are fine. Okay, what I'm gonna do is now declare an interest in Iberia and take this stupid-ass treaty port. Which Morocco has a claim on for some reason. Take this treaty port right here. So, uh, France would actually join it. I wanna liberate someone. Andalusia would be good. You know what? I'll take Valencia and liberate Andalusia. Thirty infamy. Liberate Andalusia. And Spanish war reps. For the, uh, for the French. Then France should take over as war leader. France, I, I, I gave you... Oh, I don't have enough maneuvers. <laughs> well, that's unfortunate. Morocco sides... Right. This is what we in the business call a second general. With five people defending on this front with all its conscription sectors activated. <laughs> I mean, technically, it's fine. This is gonna go up to 15. Oh god, why did you send... Why did you send a general there, Spain? France, you will lose territory from this war if you don't help me. Just wanted to mention, this is not fine. Let's see if this is fine. This is actually fine. We can push. We can push here. I'm gonna push here. And then just, I just try to push them out as soon as I can possibly do it. We might actually do it. Hello, baby. Oh, we actually just win. Bro is, bro is unfortunately in a pocket, which is, un which is not cool. Okay, part of my nation is occupied, which you hate to see. Gonna make more furniture. 
We are just gonna go ahead and defend the front with both generals. We are on a minus 22 here, there is no need to push. Especially considering we own one of our war goals, and they do not. Yeah, I won't fall below zero because they do not own L Reef. And they will not be owning L Reef. They're happy plus seven, which isn't enough for this. I'm gonna try again, but it's likely not gonna help. Francis bankrolling us based. Yeah, we are completely annihilating them. We get ourselves canneries, which you love to see. We're gonna immediately go ahead and get them. Over in our food industries, we're gonna get ourselves better tools, or more of them to be exact. And we have suddenly reached a plus 17 over here, so we're gonna go ahead and advance the front with both of our generals. I'm pretty sure they're still gonna get one offensive in. No, we both attacked. Uh, we are winning the defensive and also winning the offensive. You love to see it. But they are, they are really adamant on attacking. Okay, I'm losing a lot of money. 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 Why am I losing so much money? Probably because I have everyone mobilized. Nevertheless, kind of a bra moment, honestly. Me win. Actually, I kind of want to do this. There we go. How do you have so much war support? Like, what? It is kind of rude. We are winning that defensive even though they're front split in two and we are now up here in the north. Our offensive is somehow going down. Anyways, Morocco is out of the war. Uh, I guess I'll just stay here with my money bleeding dry. I could, uh, stop the enlistment efforts, which should hopefully bring that down. Yeah, it did. But now I'm, I'm actually just losing money because of interest. Rich manufacturing industries instead. Oh, I could, you know, tax something. I'm gonna tax something. Don't encourage manufacturing industries in these two, and get something over here instead. Tobacco, sure. We're now making money. Well, it's at war with Spain. The fact that I'm at war with Spain is kind of rude, to be honest. Oh, Prussia's getting owned. Oh, Austria actually went for German leadership. Like, Austria declared the war. Yeah, you can see why. <laughs> Take a gander over here. Yeah, the, uh, Prussia is getting absolutely, like, ruffled stomped over here. Gonna add wine. This isn't fast enough. Right, so now we're in this endless war. This is very stupid. Oh, they tried a landing over here. That's crazy. How many ships do you got? So, uh, I'm definitely not doing a naval invasion, is what you're saying. This guy is loved. <laughs> like, they really just... <laughs> he's a masterful diplomat, celebrity commander. Everyone knows and loves this guy. He's been doing nothing but getting dubs on the battlefield. Like, <laughs> he's so based. He's also expert defensive strategist. He just knows what he's doing, yet this... 103, it's almost the highest defense in the world. And at one point, it was the highest defense in the world. Time to get a national guard. I've seen enough. You know, it has just occurred to me that I'm gonna have to uh, play as all of these Indian nations and four separate Yemens. Uh, I'm gonna have to play as every Ethiopia. Uh, El Salvador. Dude, more defense. <laughs> <laughs> North German Federation, baby. Why do you always look different? <laughs> oh, sh oh, you've gone ahead and conquered Dynam. You've gone ahead and conquered Dynam and not Spain. Why don't you want a little bit of Catalonia, huh? A little bit of Catalonia, Aragon, and Navarra. Why don't you want the free? But make the borders look nicer. Oh, and now I can see. <laughs> That's actually the highest defense in the world. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, I uh, can't believe can't believe that Algeria has the highest defense in the world with 120 120 Can you just accept? Can you accept please? Turmoil in Spain gives you a plus 23 to accept. Please. They're bankrolling me again. That's awesome. Wait, why are you bankrolling me? I am making money. I'm making less money now that you're bankrolling me. You've stopped bankrolling me. I'm paying you war reps. I am paying you war reparations and you're bankrolling my ass. Industrial boom. The textile mills are doing The textile mills are just doing it. Bruh. How much am I paying in diplomatic? 2k! 2k! I would be making bank if France wasn't stealing it. Let's upgrade the iron mines. And this... Why would that be less? What? Why would that make less money? I don't understand. Anyways, Spain tried, Spain tried to uh, land again, but it was actually so quick I couldn't click on it in time. <laughs> Currency standards. The video ends when I'm not at war with Spain. Uh, in it, oh my god, you love to see it. Advise him not to do it. It's so, it's so true, honestly. You know what? You shouldn't be doing that. 
It says the Spanish gold reserves. You make a good point. Like you are minus 11 from this away. Because you love to see a white piece. But why? <laughs> like what? I want this, but I also want this and this. Can I just get this? It is a, it's as worth to you as this. This is a, the, the, this is objectively worth more. What are, what are the end illusion costs? It doesn't tell me anywhere. That's awesome. Why does not? I mean, Western Andalusia and Eastern Andalusia is like a good, it's like a good guess here. <laughs> it has, it's in, the, it, it has it in the name. Okay, I know that Poland has a core on this, but where does it say it? This card with the industrialist? Ah, oh, sure. You know, sometimes I just kind of forget to uh, press the build button again uh, after I'm done. <laughs> so, uh, whoops. I'm gonna do this, which will make uh, this less good, but then I get this. I don't need to make that much money anymore. So, uh, we go back. We going! Still ba I, I'm, oh, because I'm a Dominion. That's not because of the war reps. Okay. So the war reps are now gone, but I'm paying 2k because I'm a Dominion. Which is rude. We got ourselves a national guard in the time that Fr Spain has managed to do nothing. Can you, like, take Gibraltar? Can I, like, hold on. What? Wait, hold on. Watch me do a funny. <laughs> I violated British sovereignty. <laughs> I think it's pretty funny. <laughs> oh, they landed! They <laughs> <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this.